Steph Curry. Oh man, beautiful day. Now we're getting the 70 degree temperature. Now I'm gonna come out here every morning and ride my bike for about two hours, nice. Start getting some exercise. Ooh, good weather, man. Let's do this. Obstacles. That's what we're gonna talk about today. Some obstacles and um, talking about creating an outline text. So let's head to the shop. Funny is that since childhood all the way to about maybe 40, 43 years old, I couldn't get over 170 pounds. I had a very fast metabolism. And ever since what, 43 to now, I'm 51, I have gained about 40 pounds. I guess my metabolism has slowed down and I kept eating the same thing. I'm still eating all the same stuff. Unbelievable, it's time to do a little exercise and get rid of this because look at this Damn! oh no this is not good never i've never been a heavy guy or, uh, or a guy with a lot of weight no i always struggle to even get to 170. now i'm like 210. wow obstacles right so something gets in your way and you can think of how to get past that thing or go over or around that thing that's obstacles. You are going to notice a lot of obstacles when you're starting a business, screen printing business, any other. You're an entrepreneur, you're gonna face a lot of obstacles. Um, an obstacle is I wanna start screen printing, but I got no money in the bank. I got the press, I got a flasher, I got some money in the bank, but I need more space, I got no space, I gotta get out from where I'm at, obstacles. You know, I want to learn Photoshop, but I don't know. I have to get a Photoshop. I don't know how to do it. Obstacles. You're going to go through a lot of obstacles. Starting this screen printing business, that's where you're going to get through the most obstacles. And just focus on these obstacles. How, I, how, how you could be able to pass these obstacles, because that's what's going to make your screen printer. What makes your screen printer is how well you go through these obstacles, because they're going to come. But let me tell you, the most hardest obstacles are at the beginning when you're starting this business. Once you get moving and you go through uh, all those obstacles, there's gonna be obstacles, but none of them will compare to the first obstacles. And yes, there's a bunch of YouTube motivational videos about obstacles. They're gonna tell you all how you go these obstacles, but really there's only one thing that you have to get so you'll be able to just get through any obstacles. But before that, I want to tell you something. This video is sponsored by Printavo. Printavo is a management cloud-based software. Printavo will help you manage orders, handle scheduling, automation, and online stores. Regardless if you are a small or a big print shop, Printavo will help you streamline your business. One thing I just put Printavo was on the test last month with so many orders. It was so easy, wifey in the house, so she didn't have to keep calling me and telling me this, check the email, and the email, you get so many emails, you go, you get lost. Here, you know what you're gonna do today, you know what artists approved, you know who accepted the quote, you know who made the payments, and what order is next, and that's one thing I like about Printavo. So if, you go, if you're interested, go to Printavo.com, and Printavo is having a 50% off the first month by just using the promo code Taino. That's a pretty good deal. So if you're interested, go to Printavo.com and I want to give a big thanks to Printavo for sponsoring today's video. Now, let's go check that screen.
One of the most used designs you're gonna encounter with when it comes to screen printing is actually just text. Anything that has to do with text, you're gonna get a lot of requests. What we're talking about today is, all ones that they ask a lot is a text with an outline, or a text with an outline but separated from the font itself, or a text with just the outline. You know, so you're gonna get that. That's what we're gonna talk about today. Very simple doing it on Photoshop. So here it is, let's do this. Just click on, and what we're gonna type is obstacles, right? That's the what we're looking at. So once you have that font type obstacles, very simple. All you gotta do is scroll down, and when you see FX, when you see FX here, just click FX and go to blending options. This little window is gonna pop up. What you're looking for is where it says stroke. You're gonna click on stroke, and there you go, you're gonna have your color black, if that's the outline that you wanna do, but you're gonna size up on the structure part, you're gonna size up, and you wanna get maybe about maybe 30, 35, that's a good number, 35, and you're gonna click okay, and that's, one way of doing just an outline, very simple. Now the person just wants the outline. They don't want the red in there. They just want just the outline, no font, very simple. All you gotta do is go back to FX, go to blending options again, and this time you're gonna click on blending options and you're gonna see general blending and advanced blending. Go to fill, advanced blending, and go to fill opacity and you're gonna Slide it down to zero, and there goes the outline, just the outline. That's another part that they do. Very simple, very quick, nothing, nothing wrong with that. Now, let's, um, let's go back here. Let me start all over. Now, let's say you just want that outline separated from the font. You want that space in between the font and the outline. Very simple, we're gonna go again to FX, and we're gonna go to Blending Options, you could just hit stroke, but I just want to show everything. And then you're going to go stroke. Once you hit, once you hit stroke, this is the difference. The color, what you want to do is make sure that it's in white. Once you have that white color there, just print OK. And now you're going to come and you're going to see, you're going to go up to a little bit, same thing, number 32, 35. But you don't see the white because you have a white background. So what you want to do is press OK. Once you have that okay, now you come and you're gonna click on your layer and you're gonna rasterize layer style. Once it's rasterized, now is that white is there with that font. So now we're gonna go back to the FX. We're gonna go ahead and stroke. And this time we're gonna do the black. And you see the outline already coming out. And what you wanna do is have a little outline right there Real nice, just the outline with it, and just press OK. And there goes your outline, just the outline, separated from the font, and that's another way of doing it. So let me right now finish closing up, and let's talk about obstacles. Obstacles, talked about it earlier, you're gonna go through them every time. But this is one thing that you could just tackle obstacles much easier and you need it. People talk about work and hustle hard all the time, put in the work, all these things they put there, but they forget one thing, and it's called faith. You gotta have faith. You gotta have faith in the Lord that he's gonna favor you. You know, faith is very important. And taking that and using something with it, and it's called imagination. You have to have an imagination. We all do, even when we kids, we always imagining things, you know? The problem is that when you imagine something is something that is not really seen, only you could see it, nobody else could see it. That's why when you tell it to your family and friends, they shut it down. And the worst thing you could do is, oh, okay, it doesn't work, because they see it. They don't see it, you see it. So imagination is the most important thing when you're going into any type of business. You have to imagine yourself buying a six color, eight color press, a conveyor dryer, an exposure unit. I'm gonna get clients. I, I imagine myself doing a grand opening in my business. Beautiful, 
only you could see that. Imagination is everything. That's what Albert Einstein said. Albert Einstein said, imagination is everything. It's a preview to life's coming attraction. Oh, that is from the smartest man in the world. He knew that imagination is everything. And if you imagine and don't let other people shut it down, it's not because they're hating, they're hating. They're, they're not hating, they just don't see it because imagination is something that you cannot really see only yourself. And having faith and believing in God, oh man, you're gonna be favored and you're gonna see slowly things progressing. I imagine this. I imagine this here and I can believe it. And that is what it's all about imagination so if you like this video press that like button if you haven't subscribed yet please subscribe be thankful always be grateful always and just let god take you on the ride peace out